Hi everyone, it's Alicia with the Dockerty Dozen. And this is my weekly grocery haul for my family of 14. However, I did not grocery shop last week. So this week is going to be a little bit bigger haul than normal. I am going to Costco tomorrow for the water and Gatorade and paper towels and toilet paper, that kind of stuff. Um, but this is for groceries for the week. Um, here is our meal plan. This is our dinner menu that we made together as a family for the week. From there, I expanded to add in what we'll have for breakfast and lunch every day. And then I made my grocery list separated out by areas of the store. So let's go. But first, coffee. All right, I'm going to get my bags. I also need to give my van a car wash. All right. I'm going to grab two. Lots of bags today. Back at Wegmans, I've been at Walmart the past few weeks, so I'm coming back here today. And I'm gonna start at the back of the store. today because I have not had a chance to drink it all yet. Woo! Don't spill. Bags down here. Cart one. Alright. I need a lot of snackies. We are also all out of AA batteries. I'm gonna get some AAA while I'm here too. Let's get some more Bills plates for the Bills game today. You know the big ones? No. They might have them in the other section. Oh, I need laundry detergent. Did not write that on my list. Just remembered, I ran out this week at the laundromat and had to, had to buy some out of the machine. I'm just gonna get this one because those things are super tiny. That will last like two loads for me. Always need dish soap in my house. Oh, I need envelopes. Also, not on my list. Random things I remember when I'm in the store. Okay. Bags. Okay, I got sandwich bags. I got gallon bags. Kids like to pack a snack in these sometimes, so I'm gonna get more of those. Get some more aluminum foil. Wow, this cart is filling up fast. I'm trying a couple new recipes this week, so I have to get some of the basics for those uh, recipes that I don't usually have on in stock. I need a chili paste and. Okay, I'm totally gonna butcher how to say this. Poison sauce? Poison? H-O-I-S-I-N. Poison. I have raised vinegar. I need that for the recipe as well. I'm making um, Asian lettuce wraps one night. Oh, there we go. Poison sauce. Of course, there's different kinds. I'm gonna go with this one. And then chili paste, I'm gonna guess is right here. I have sesame oil, I have rice vinegar, I have soy sauce. 
Oh, I need oyster sauce. Okay, there's chili sauce. I need chili paste. It's gotta be here somewhere, right? There we go. Okay, chili paste. Chili paste, I'm gonna go this one. Okay. Also need rice. Um, we really like this. Hmm. No, I can't find it. Let me look in the other aisle. Yes, there's two aisles of rice. <laughs> I can't find it. We really like parboiled rice because it doesn't stick together at all. Oh, there it is. Okay, yes. Love our boiled rice. Coffee break. All right, Josh also wanted some of these ready rice that you just like throw in the microwave if you want one serving of rice real quick. So I'm gonna get some of these. Excuse me, a recipe. Alright, we are all out of our applesauce pouches. I got four ketchups. Mayonnaise. And red hot for buffalo chicken we get. Salad dressings. Kids have been eating salad a lot lately. Alright. Uh, yeah, I wish Costco carried this. If they do, I've not found it there yet. Let's go set it up front and get another cart. Okay, I always go and make sure I find the manager so I tell them I'm piling my carts up front so they don't start restocking stuff. And let's go get cereal because part two. I did not um, meal plan this past week as we like settled back in from our whirlwind weekend at New York City. So the kids had a lot of cereal for breakfast. So now we're gonna restock the cereal. Three new pebbles, cocoa pebbles. Basically every single cereal in this aisle. My kids also do this fun thing where they leave the box of cereal in the pantry with like two crumbs of cereal left. So I'll have to go through and clear those out and then put these in.
they can just go through real quick and scan all the UPC codes. I don't even put them in bags or anything. So we requested Pop Tarts last night. Sunday ones. Oh, look how cute these ones are. <laughs> That's cute. Cookies and cream, but I don't see Hot Fudge Sunday anymore. We need more syrup. Also, I'm gonna get another big bag of waffle mix. All right, so let's get some of these fun cupcake liners. No, you know what? Let's check Costco for those. You know I need those in bulk. I've got oil. I probably need cooking spray though. I got this one last time and I'm not loving it. It's like spraying out. It's not like spraying, it's more of like a power jet. <laughs> this one sprays, so we're getting this. And also, somebody please remind me to get sugar and flour at Costco. Always forget that. Okay. I wanted to get some different M&Ms for the kids. We're making, decorating gingerbread houses today. So, I like to have different flavors and sizes. I'm sorry, M&Ms, chocolate chips. Ooh, can you tell it's 6 a.m. on a Sunday? Um, let's see, like white, okay, butterscotch. And, oh, let's get peanut butter, yum. Do they have the white ones? Yes, here we go. Okay, I also need frostings. Okay, so white, green, red, blue. Let's just get like a bunch of these. I have a huge tub of frosting, so I just need the icing. So what I do is I'm gonna put them on the table and the kids will like share. So like every three kids will share one. kids who will dump the entire thing of sprinkles on anything. <laughs> Do you guys have one of those? All right, I gotta get gingerbread house kids. Oh, this one's pre-built. I love you, whatever company you are. This is what Harley was talking about. Harley had tubes put in her ears this week. And <laughs> like when kids wake up from surgery and they're all loopy, she's like, I want some of those pretzels. The good ones with the, with the sprinkles. <laughs> yes, Harley, I'll get you the good ones. 
<laughs> like what? Of all things, this is what she wanted after surgery. I also need Rolos. I keep buying these things to like, you know, make stuff with and then my kids eat them before I make the thing I wanted to make with them. Are there any holiday M&Ms around here? No. Well, kind of. <gasps> yes, there is. Yes. Okay, here we go. We need a bag. Okay, I've told this story before, but every time I use those, I think of it and it makes me laugh. I'm actually gonna double bag this um, because when we first got James, when he moved in, he was six years old uh, from foster care. And like he had just moved in, we came to Wegmans. Back, you know, when he first moved in, I didn't realize he would just run, he would just like take off with his gone. Like next to you one second, you'd go like that and you'd turn around and he could be a mile away. So anyways, I didn't realize that because he had just moved in. So, also I turn around, I'm like, where's James? I hear this horrible sound of a zillion M&Ms hitting the ground. What's James? It's James. He had, we laugh about it, but anyway, he had gone over to these and just like pulled the levers and the M&Ms were falling everywhere. Okay, anyways, um, this card's full, so I'm gonna go put this up front too. And I still need candy canes, but I'm gonna get those in a different candy section because they only had mini candy canes over there. Okay, clapping these up front. Cart three. These are the foods that Zoe lives off of. The trifecta pack again. Love this pack. I think I'm good on that. Yeah, I got that at BJ's. Just not the barbecue chips that a lot of my kids like. She's been packing these for his snack for school. The dish on his cosmic brownies. Okay, I also need crushed pineapple for a recipe. And then oranges. I need to go back to the Asian aisle and get water chestnuts. Cherries. There we go. Water chestnuts. Just get a bunch of these because I need them for two recipes this week. 
Let's look up some channels. Oh, there they are. Love these noodles. Gotta get juice. I need. Okay, so I'm gonna quadruple the recipe. So I need one of these for each. So I need four of these, basically. One times four is four. Okay. And then I need. Um, which they always move on me lately. Okay, X still on the end cap. for this same recipe. The kids and I are making some holiday treats. So I forgot to get Hershey Kisses. Is that the biggest bag? No, there's a bag. I'm also going to get raisins for their gingerbread houses and gingerbread men cookies. <laughs> I'm ruining the perfect display. Yeah, good. I can reface I them. The top, the okay. <laughs> Alright, Just remembered we're out of queso. Twins can't have those their tostitos without queso. Look at these little holiday trees. <laughs> it's a party every day at my house. <laughs> okay, needed pretzels for my Rolo bites. I almost forgot hot chocolate. All right, they're out of stock of all the fun marshmallows. And this looks fancy. Mm. Okay, what's the difference? This is marshmallow swirl, chocolate, chocolate. Let's try both of those. Okay, this was the other candy section I was talking about. Right, candy canes for the new tree. Holiday M&M's here. Oh well. 
I already got some. All right, this is full. Let's go put it up front. Oh, I should grab these too for their decorating. Those are wreaths. Spice straps. I, I don't know how I'll fit it all in the car. I haven't figured that out yet. Okay, because I have so much today, they're actually gonna start ringing cards one through three while I get the next stuff I need. Okay. Part four. Oh, wow. Okay, right. All right, I'm gonna get produce in this cart. Somebody was asking for strawberries last night. I'm like, we have not gone shopping this week. So, we are low. Fresh produce. In fact, while I am here shopping, Josh um, made banana bread with the bananas that went brown while we were in New York City. fresh produce. This is a major restock. Wait, where's the five pound bags? Oh, there they are. It's good. Peppers. So Josh is back on his diet, which is not for weight loss. It is actually for his um, cholesterol, blood pressure, that runs in his family. So, we gotta get him his veggies and all of his fish, because he'll eat fish every night now. Get his blood pressure down. He loves Brussels sprouts. I don't understand it. Where is the family pack of peppers? Not seeing it. level here. <laughs> Josh loves Red Delicious. That one's not good. Uh, okay. These are better. And Bree and Jason love the green apples. bags of these because they're smaller. Okay. Alright, it looks like... Oh! They have a couple family packs left. Woohoo! Okay, I need these for a couple recipes. No, that one's like bad. Oh, these are all like wilted already. Not gonna buy that. several recipes this week. Okay, these ones look good that are in the repack. So we'll get, we'll get some of those. Recipe I'm making this week. That 
reminds me, I have a zillion recipes to post. I really need to do those. I also still have to post Around the World Night New Zealand. These things sit in my drafts and I forget to post them because ADHD. Some kiwi always looks awesome on holiday snack boards because it's green. A bunch of salad, like I said, the kids are in a salad phase. Some spinach. That one looks, I don't know. Actually, look at you will never believe me. Washed and ready to eat. Alright, they got the big packs back. normally on my list. buns because we're having chili cheese dogs for lunch next Saturday. Oh, I guess I need Hawaiian logs. This. Chicken some. Hot 
weapons. in this part too. We can do it. Yes, we can. Okay. Y'all, I'm gonna simplify my life. And buy pre-made gingerbread and cookies. You know what? Cut corners when you can. Save sanity. Save time. It's okay. You're still a great mom. All right, how many are in these? 12, 24. Bada bing, bada boom. All right, I like to have this on hand. Just in case. Shuvo meds for the middles. Middles, littles. Golden flu season with 14 of us. It's a long season. Alright, I'm out of cotton balls and cotton rounds. Nitrogen peroxide. Okay, I normally buy the twins hair products from Kelly Bless. Um, she's been out of town. So, I need to get something. I need to get an oil for the twin hair until we get that supply in. Um, no. No. By the way, Jordan's been doing an awesome job taking care of his own hair. Well, so is Jason, but... His hair's a different texture, so his hair's easy. Okay, I think this might work until we get our other oil in. Yeah, another one. Thank you. All right, let's go get the mounts. What are we, cart five? Cart five. Milk restock, which is always good to do at some point. Kind of like not shop for a week and then we dwindle down on everything, you know. Ran out of milk, ran out of a lot of stuff. John and Patrick are drinking a ton of vanilla almond milk. Maya and Dash and Alex. And sometimes Harley like the chocolate almond milk. Yes, I just 
third one on your mention. this they used to be here but now the sandwich meats are here like why they switch that I don't know <laughs> okay we'll get some ham we'll get some turkey all right oh hot dogs can't have chili cheese dogs without hot dogs I forgot to check inventory before I left. Well, it looks like they're out of the big yolk crunch anyways, so. No, they're not. There we go. Our Lunchables. left. 
leaves and I need six of them for recipes this week. That's okay. I can substitute ground beef. Oh, that's what I needed. Perfect. Thank you. Never mind, he's restocking it. Okay, you need six of these. Three for chili, three for lasagna. frozen stuff. So I'm going to put this up front, grab a cart for those last few things. Okay, one more cart, a couple more things. And I didn't bring my list, so we're going to go by memory. Cart six, I think. All right, pizza. Thanksgiving. Oh, I'm gonna get some of this lactose free ice cream. start snowing. Like five minutes ago. Oh my gosh. All right, I'm gonna get my van. 
All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven? Seven cards? Yep. All right, so I leave my cards outside that side back door, whatever it is. I'm gonna drive up and load everything. Ooh, slippery. This is like slushy, slippery sound falling right now. I lost my coffee at some point in that. <laughs> Hopefully it turns up. Slippery. Here we go. Alright, every single crevice of this van is full of groceries. Everywhere. This is what happens when I skip a week of grocery shopping. It is snowing and Deshaun is going to the Buffalo Bills game in this. Mm -mm, no, I will be watching it <laughs> from my couch. <laughs> he actually, he'll be gone when I get back. Or just leaving when I get back. He's going with his girlfriend's family. It was his birthday present from them. The first, he was supposed to go to the One Bills game with them, but it got moved to Detroit. So it got rescheduled for today's game against the Jets. He's so excited. Also, it was not online much yesterday because Deshaun had a wrestling tournament that lasted 12 hours. Um, it was a really fun day, but it was a really long day. It was like every school in our area. He got fourth place in his weight class. He is not happy with that, but I'm so proud of him. He's in eighth grade, like wrestling with high schoolers because they pulled him up to the high school team. I'm so proud of him. But yeah, it was a long day, long day. Anyways, the service in the school was obviously wacky. So I was barely online. I was like, every time we'd go, so in between matches, I'd be like, okay, I'm gonna go run errands or I'm gonna go this. And I would kind of like catch up on texts and stuff. So much for straightening my hair this morning. <laughs> well, it was not snowing when I left. So, I did use my, so the $50 gift card I posted about yesterday, those were like auto set to publish those videos yesterday. That's how they published while I was at the wrestling tournament. Um, the $50 gift card that Wegmans gifted me for being a top shopper was like digital on my shopping account. So that got used today, so thank you Wegmans. I did not mean to sound ungrateful in yesterday's vlog. The reason I was laughing is because everybody thinks that I'm sponsored by Wegmans and I must get like all this money from Wegmans for shopping there every week and making vlogs and stuff and like I'm not. So that's why I was laughing just because I am definitely grateful for a $50 gift card. I hope you paid for those gingerbread houses. Oh, and that makes me think of another thing. On my Instagram or our Instagram, I do giveaways. I do them throughout the year. Um, and right now I have several giveaways. So definitely check that out. I like to gift people more so in December, just because I know people need extra money for the holidays. So, I've got one giveaway going on in my stories with a couple creators. Um, I have another giveaway coming up this week with a couple other creators. And it's, both of those giveaways are for cash. Um, I'm going to do one more giveaway, again, cash. For, you know, Christmas, whatever, whatever you need it for. Um, I am not doing Around the World Night this month. We have a lot going on. Around the World Night takes me, like, we love it. I personally love it. It's just, like, fun for me. It breaks up the monotony of 
meal planning. Um, the kids love it because it's trying new food and stuff and learning about other countries. However, it's very time consuming because I have to research it and learn new recipes and, you know, just, just time consuming. Anyways, we have a lot going on this month. Really, really exciting stuff. Um, now that the New York City trip is out of the way, that was like our main exciting thing. But <clears throat> we hit a million subscribers on YouTube. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We have a huge like celebration, I guess you could call it. Um, or how we're going to celebrate hitting a million subscribers is coming. Um, I might post it on Christmas or the day after Christmas. It'll be around Christmas when it posts, but it's kind of like a month long endeavor <laughs> that we are working on. Um, so yeah, that's kind of like taking up time, good time. Uh, but I have to cut corners on other time. Not to mention, I still have to do like, you know, Christmas shopping for my kids and I shop for the biological families of my kids and all of that. So yeah, it's crazy, crazy busy, all in a good, wonderful, amazing way. I had to cut corners. So Around the World Night is gonna be on hold for this month. It will resume in January. I will have to reassess what night I do it. I'm probably gonna switch it. I gotta look at the schedule. So it changes. Every night of the week has like a theme. Although this week I didn't even stick to that. But like <laughs> we do a grill night every week. We do a taco theme night every week. We do a um, crock pot night every week. So you see what I mean? Like every dinner theme sticks on that night every week. But those nights change each season based on the kids activity and sports schedules. So our busiest night of the week, I try to make crock pot night. So I got to switch that to Monday in January. Um, because that way, when we get home from our zillion activities that all fall on Monday, dinner's made. Our simplest, um, and then another busy night, I'll do grill night because James will grill for me, which is amazing. Um, so I can be like running kids here, there, everywhere, and he'll be at home grilling dinner, which is awesome. <gasps> Side story. So anyways. I will make up that new schedule and let you guys know when that happens. That just reminded me. See, I haven't talked to you guys in like a week because I didn't grocery shop last week. James is going to do culinary school. We're so excited. His high school runs this program. He toured it on Friday. He loved it. So starting his junior year, he will go half a day to like an out of building um, school for like trades. You learn a trade uh, and he chose culinary school. So assuming he gets in, which I think he will, he will half a day for junior and senior year be in culinary school as part of his high school education really amazing opportunity he's like excited about it it's so good when you see okay especially teens nowadays who show no enthusiasm for anything <laughs> so like when they actually show like genuine happiness and enthusiasm for something it's just contagious and then, yeah I'm really happy for him it's gonna be a really really good thing for him he wants to now he doesn't need none of my kids need a job clearly they're spoiled but he wants a job so he wants to get a job this summer as a dishwasher in a restaurant because he said I know that I'm gonna need to start from the bottom up and work my way up to being the chef he's like and I want to start now and I'm like hey yes <laughs> like what 15 year old has that much direction in life I know I did not when I was 15. When I was 15, like, what was I worried about? Like, what lip gloss I bought? I don't know. <laughs> so, yeah. So 
So we're gonna start exploring that. If anyone local knows of any restaurants that need a dishwasher this summer, starting this summer, let me know. Um, yeah. Any other updates? I don't know. I'll tell you when I know. Almost home. See, I talked that entire time. How long was that? Ten minutes. Hopefully the kids are awake so they can carry groceries. Like the mean mom I am, I texted them, you need to wake up and carry groceries. And Sean will not be home, so. Not him, but the other kids, you eat the groceries, you help carry them in, if they're home. Lately I've been grocery shopping during the week, so they haven't been home. But if they're home, oh yes, they help carry them. They All they have to do is walk them from the van two feet into the garage and then I put everything away. Whenever anyone else puts anything away, I can't find it all week. So it actually like wastes time. Plus, like I said, I have to go through the pantry and take out all of the things that my kids decide to put in there empty. Yep, last night I threw out an empty bag of Rolos, two empty boxes of, I'm sorry, recycled. We have recycling here in New York. Two empty boxes of cosmic brownies. A couple empty, yeah, just like, I'm like, why? Why, why do we do that? Right, I am. The time it took me to drive home, there's a layer of snow on the ground. Me? Yeah. Hey, Zoe. Come on here. Thank you. Thank you. Teamwork makes the dream work. Record me what? That you made banana bread while I was gone. I did. I'm so proud of you. He yeah. even recorded a vlog for you guys. Oh, I'm proud of you. I'll send you the video. Okay. Alright, Bree's still helping me. The rest of the kids are running around doing a snowball fight. <laughs> me and Alex are. <laughs> Thank you. Laundry's gotta go. Laundry mat. Groceries that has to be put away. Uh, it was pretty cool. Okay, here's the receipt. Patrick playing the recorder in the background. Sorry for that. Who doesn't love a little recorder at 8 a.m.? You don't? Not your favorite. Oh Alright, kids and Josh are gonna watch Elf while Alex and I put groceries away. And I just ate some of Josh's banana bread. It was awesome. What Patrick? Are you gonna get are you you didn't get you and Dad one? No, we'll have to help the babies, so oh, okay. we'll do gingerbread houses through helping the babies. Some stuff away. Thank you. They're all organized too. My O C D kicked in. All right, those chocolate milks you can actually stack because it gives you more room. Oh, these can stack here? Mm -hmm. Oh, I thought they were too small. I'm too big. No, they fit. They good. Is Natalie coming over? Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. Is she coming to the museum with us? No, she can't. Oh. Because um, she has to get all of her stuff done. Ah. But she'll be here like when we get back, though. I think I'll just like put the extra tickets there and... And let someone else Whoever's have Whoever's behind us will be oh, yeah. surprised yeah. with yeah. free tickets. Yeah. I don't know what I was thinking. You're thinking that Marissa and, uh, 16 tickets. You thought Marissa and, uh, Nelly. Alright, so I put all the meat in that fridge. Well, you can't. Oh, I thought you meant frozen meat. I was about to say. So... Alright, I'm gonna put this away. You still have some of these? Oh, I don't like the um. What is it? What is it called? The, I don't like the roast beef. Oh, I love roast beef. I haven't tried the bologna yet. It's salty. Is it? It's alright though. Natural shirt cheddar. 
have some for Thanksgiving. All the stuff we forgot. Oh, need more butter. Well, you got that Christmas tree butter. I got Christmas tree butter, you're right. Wow, you know you have two more of these in the other fridge? The other fridge over there? I do? Yeah, well, go look. Go look. Oh, well, then let's put all the creamer in that fridge. Look at it, ready? Oh, I don't like those French vanillas. Who does? Nobody. I bought those because uh, they were out of caramel macchiato, but then somebody sent us caramel macchiato ones. So this is the only one in there, then. Okay, so those are garbage. No, that can go in that fridge there. Okay. He had just put it on the shelf. Oh, yeah, we're going to use this like, literally tomorrow. I get it. Uh, beef pork. Um, that is... How am I making that? That is for the chili on Thursday. And something. Lasagna on... Sunday, Wednesday. sandwiches. So I have to use that all natural cheese. <laughs> so that's why. Is this uh whooping whip? Whooping? I got some whooping cream. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, that weird. goes in the freezer actually. Yeah, I'm gonna have to de uh, defrost that so. Do you want me to go through any of this? If this... Mm, no, this is all good. Papa usually is pretty on top of this stuff. Yeah, I don't know why those are there. Don't know. Sometimes they just don't ask why. Yeah, but the... It's... I don't know. He likes to freeze bones. Your Duncan's back there, too. No, I thought you meant the one from my car. Oh, no, we brought that in. These kids will eat them. Dijon. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God you got more pancakes mix. I did. I'm going to make more pancakes now. Where does the pancake mix go? Come on, no, no, there's a ton of room in there. Oh, okay. Right where I put the other ones are. In the, in the... Like, if you just got, like, tons of little ones for that, Mom? Yeah. That whole, that whole thing could just be full of your creamer. These are going inside. We're having these for lunch. Okay. Go 
Gonja cha chunga. That's her recipe here. Oh. Chili paste. Just say the English version. <laughs> Chili paste. Towels, tissues, toilet paper, not tissues, toilet paper. But you else. said you said you hurt your back last time, so yeah, I'm just gonna have to suck it up. If I need it for a recipe, I'm like, I better just buy it so I have it just in case. Because it'll get used either way. What about all these keto cookies? That is for dessert. Not tonight, but we're going to eat the gingerbread houses tonight. chicken maker and I'll make candy yams, mashed potatoes, stuff. Can you leave some of these? Uh, maybe. Maybe. That's their video this week, so I don't know if I'll get to that today. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 
All right, just a few more things to put away and then we're gonna start another vlog with our new rotisserie chicken maker. So look out for that vlog as well. Thank you for coming grocery shopping with me. You are strong, you are beautiful, you are loved. So proud of you. I'll see you next time.